Hey, John Cristani here, internet marketer and tech entrepreneur. And in this video lesson, I'm gonna be going over the four P's of marketing. Now, this is an unbelievably important concept. Don't get this wrong, because if you get one of these things wrong, literally none of your marketing will work. I'm gonna go over basically promotion, place, product, and price, which are the four P's of marketing, and I'll be explaining how they all work together, what specifically you need in each one, and how it all works. So let's get into it and make some money. Hey, so John Cristani here. I've been doing marketing for about 10 years now, and I've been able to create a business that does over $7 million a year with zero employees, just myself, through the power of marketing. And I absolutely love marketing. I'm gonna be going over a really important concept here, which is called the four P's of marketing. Now, it's important, I put this up here, don't get this wrong, because if you get one of these things out of place, then your marketing won't work, and I'll explain why in just a second here. Now, as you see, the four P's are promotion, place, product, and price. But I'll be explaining each of these and I'll be explaining a concept of why all four of these actually work together sort of like a key. And if you get any one thing wrong, within these, your marketing will not work. And I'll also be going over another thing at the end of how you can use this to make money and how you really only need to understand half of these principles, only these two. And you can start earning an income like I am, where I'm earning $7 million a year, just focusing really on the top two. So first, what is promotion? So promotion is reaching customers. It's how you actually contact them. So that could be through Google, that could be through Facebook ads or a Facebook group, Facebook posts. It could be through Instagram. It could be through Snapchat. It could be through YouTube. However, you actually get out there to customers. There's free methods. Obviously, you could post on YouTube. You could put up a blog. You could put up a Facebook post, Instagram. All of this is free. Or you could advertise on all of these different channels. You could advertise on Google, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and reach people. So all of these tactics are valid. If you wanna learn more about how to specifically do each one of these tactics, I suggest you check out one of my free marketing methods, which will have somebody linked to in like a bubble. I don't know, it'll be floating around somewhere around here. And the next P is place. And what place is, is the place where you sell people. Now, the place we sell people is a website. So I'm just gonna say a website. And there's different ways of creating websites. You can create a landing page, which is just meant to move people on. If you're blogging, your blog is gonna show up on Google and people will click on your blog. However you do it, there's a lot of ways to build a website. If you wanna learn more about how to build a website and do it in just five minutes, I have a video somewhere, I'll have it also linked in the bubbles above about how you can learn to build a website in just five minutes, very simply. Now, the third P is your product. And this is pretty self-explanatory. It's either the product or the service that you're actually selling. For this example, let's use the example of my book. So I sell a book. It's a workbook. It has exercises in it. If you want to get the book, I have it. It's only a dollar digital version. Links are in the description and we have exercises and all sorts of stuff you can use in the book. And price. Price needs to be congruent too. And the price is simply the price of the product. In my case, it's $1. So I'm gonna be using my book as an example in illustrating the four Ps of marketing. So let's get rid of these and let's do this. So we're gonna use my book in the example I'm gonna put up here, but the most important concept that we're gonna to have to understand here is what I call congruency. And if every one of the Ps does not line up, if things are are not congruent throughout the entire piece, then you won't make money. And what do I mean by that? Well, let's use YouTube for instance. Let's say I choose YouTube as a place to promote. We're gonna advertise on YouTube. Of course, we're sending people to a website, but do people on YouTube typically want to read a long sales letter or do they want to watch a video? I could write about my book until I'm blue in the face or I could speak about it till I'm blue in the face too. Which would people like more if they're coming from a YouTube ad? If you made the guess, it's pretty obvious. People want a website, but there should be video on the website. If you are sending people to a website that doesn't have video, you're probably not going to do as well as if you sent them to a website that has videos on it. Because people coming from YouTube, again, the promotional element, like video, just by the nature of where they're coming from. What sort of product would people like 
to see on YouTube, a book or a video training course. In YouTube's case, if the person is coming from YouTube, they're probably gonna wanna see a video training course, okay? Because people are watching videos on YouTube. So the product is a video course. And in my own marketing efforts, I spend thousands of dollars a day. I spend anywhere from two to $20,000 every single day. YouTube's making a lot more money off of me than I'm making off of them. So I pay for ads and I actually don't promote my book through my YouTube ads. When I'm spending $10,000 a day, I'm not selling 10,000 books. I'm actually promoting my marketing course, which is a six week video training course called the Super Affiliate System. Now, if you wanna learn more about the Super Affiliate System, essentially what I teach in it is paid advertising and affiliate marketing, which is what I do for a living. You can check out some of the testimonials from some of my students, or you can click one of the links in the description. Last but not least is the price. The price needs to make sense. My video training course is $2,000 and I found is a price that makes sense for the sorts of customers I'm looking for. I'm not looking for people who are broke. I'm looking for people who had some success at some point in their lives and are action takers. That's why the price is what it is. And also my time and my money and my knowledge is valuable. But if I were to charge $5,000, if I were to charge $10,000, that price price wouldn't make sense. And just by pricing my course wrong, I believe my knowledge is worth $10,000. Many people have paid $10,000 for what I teach, but unfortunately people don't usually have credit limits that high. So the price wouldn't make sense. Even if three of the P's were checked, if the, just the price was wrong, nothing would work, nothing. And the same goes for almost everything else. If I were to change this out, we know that the price of $2,000 is fine, it's tested, but if if I were selling a book, right, let's just substitute that in. If I sold a book instead of a video course, then everything would fall apart and the marketing wouldn't work. Even if that same knowledge that was in a video course was in a book, then none of it would work. Everything would go to poop. Now, I could substitute any of these P's for something else. I could say, okay, instead of doing YouTube ads, I want to try doing SMS marketing. And none of this would work. I've tried doing SMS marketing and it just doesn't work. When people are on their phones and they get a text message, they're not looking to watch a video for five to 10 minutes and then find a marketing course. None of it works together. So in marketing, you've got to get all four elements lined up, working fully congruently, or else you will make no money. Now there's a way where you really only have to focus on two of these marketing elements and you'll do great. And you can make as much money as you want. Now what that's called is it's called affiliate marketing. And affiliate marketing essentially takes out these two elements out of the equation. You don't have to worry about product and you don't have to worry about price because another person has already done it for you. Now in my case, you can sell one of my products. You can sell my video training course or you could sell my book. And I've already figured out the product that works. I've already figured out price points that make sense. And you can go out there and all you have to focus on is the promotion and the place. All you have to do is you have to post on YouTube or Facebook or Google, and you have to set up a website in which people land on. This is the easiest way to start in marketing. Once again, I teach this in my courses, but you can learn a lot about this on my YouTube channel. You can learn about how to set up a website in five minutes, as I said. You can learn about free methods of posting on YouTube, Facebook, and Google. Now, most of the paid advertising methods are a little more skilled based and take a little bit more time to learn, which is why the training course that I have called Super Affiliate System is six weeks long. It's not six hours long, it's six weeks long because it takes time to learn some of these skills, some of these concepts in order to make a lot of money. So starting off in marketing, I say start with promotion and place and start with affiliate marketing. And if you're looking for good affiliate networks to join or if you're looking at how to get started, check out my video on how to get started with affiliate marketing. Or you can also go down to the links in my description. I suggest you sign up for every single affiliate network. So hopefully you'll get accepted to a few of them. Now, I hope you learned something from this video. Let me know what concept was uh, the most intriguing to you. Was it just the four P's? Was it congruency? Was it that you can't swap out? one of the elements, let me know in the comments and also let me know if I'm going too fast 
or if I'm going too slow, if you'd like me to just speed things up, or if, if the pacing was just right. Again, I'm here to serve you. I'm here to help teach marketing. And if you're looking to get more involved in learning marketing, if this excites you, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so that you're aware. I do question and answer sessions every now and again. Those are sort of impromptu. And also, if you wanna get involved in the community, which is one of the best ways to learn, is join one of our communities. We have a Discord chat channel. We have a subreddit forum and we have a Facebook group, all of which you can join, meet others and interact, ask questions, what have you to better learn marketing and get involved. Thanks for watching and looking forward to seeing you in my next video.